I spent the first seven years of my life in an urban area that was predominantly a black neighborhood. The neighborhood became unsafe to the point where my parents moved us to a rural part of Ohio in an area of lower middle class white people. I spent the next eight years of my life as one of three minorities in the whole school. And from there, my family moved in with my grandpa, who lived in the suburb of a predominantly upper middle class white community, where I went to a private school that had a mix of both white and black classmates. So in addition to being half white and half black, I've had the gift of being exposed to multiple communities, cultures, and ways of life. In my life, I've experienced change. And in my experience, change is life's only constant. And we're experiencing change, not only physiological, but also in metaphorical ways. At the most fundamental level, at the center of our solar system, our sun is in a constant state of changing hydrogen into helium. This is a process called nuclear fusion, and it's the source of our light and heat. It generates the light we receive to dictate the body's circadian rhythm, and it produces the heat that sustains our habitats. Going a little bit closer to home, the very cells in our own body regenerate themselves in a process called apoptosis, in which over 200 billion cells in your body die each day and new ones come in to replace them. Which means in about 7 to 10 years, your body has all new cells than the previous decade. And to bring it even closer to home, neuroplasticity is our brain morphing to incoming information and adjust neural pathways as a result. What this all means is that nature's evolution and human innovation have a symbiotic relationship. It is nature's great mysteries that are our puzzles, and we should be grateful for these challenges and changes as it generates meaning for our existence. Life throws us variety to see how we'll do, and how we adjust dictates who we are as a result. Being patient with yourself while adjusting to change and meeting others at the same place is all we can do in a world that's all change. Thank you so much. Have a great week.